Now, our latest 12 on 12 digital original, The War on Alzheimer's. It's an in-depth and emotional look at this memory robbing disease. Alzheimer's is the sixth leading cause of death in this country, and there is no cure. For those living with the tragic disease, it seems like they're on a journey that never ends. Mary Ellen Langworthy knows the pain and frustration of living with Alzheimer's disease. We sat down with Mary Ellen, who tells me she's scared about what might happen to her down the road. Yeah, I was still surprised when they said Alzheimer's. I, I said, I said, I don't believe it. Mary Ellen Langworthy knows a pain no one wants to feel. Well, I think at first I felt a lot of shame and I didn't want to talk about it. Um, I, I don't know, I felt like it was, something was really wrong that I did or I don't even know what the, the logical part of that is, but I felt a lot of shame. First diagnosed in 2017, Mary Ellen now lives each day in fear of losing who she is deep down inside. It's frustrating, isn't it? Yes, it is. Does it wear on you when you, when you think well, that? Well, yes. And I think um, what it does each time that that happens is sort of um, touch the place in me that's horrified and sort of terrified. And, um, and that's not real pleasant. What are you terrified about? Well, I'm, I'm terrified of losing my autonomy and my identity and becoming somebody that even I don't know who I am, you know. When you look in the mirror, though, you still see you. Oh, yes, and I still feel very much like I'm my, myself now. Mary Ellen tells me the changes in her health are slow. While she tries to keep busy, she's more forgetful, tired, and needs at least two naps a day, knowing her body and mind need the rest. What is something that you really miss that you can't do anymore? Yeah, I miss being really quick-witted and funny. I. Uh, sometimes I can pull it off, yep. <laughs> but um, not as much as I used to be able to. Marilyn's a very nice lady. She's an accomplished author and psychologist and told me the words just aren't there anymore, and she's not sure why. Mary Ellen is hoping to make a difference. She's a study participant in a clinical trial for a drug that seeks to break down and remove amyloid protein buildup in the brain. Right now on WPRI.com, hear more from Mary Ellen, plus one man's story of how he's trying to make a difference in keeping people healthy and the groundbreaking work being done to someday find our first Alzheimer's survivor.